ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Star Citizen. Look at those Panther repeaters just doing work, and they overheated. Awesome. So today we're, we are touring the F7C Hornet, and um, I thought it was going to be way more, uh, you know, in-depth than what it really is. <laughs> I mean, here it is. <laughs> So I'm back in the PTU. Uh, what happened was uh, they released the 314 patch live and it had a bunch of issues, right? I mean, of course it did. So we're back in the PTU and being back in the PTU, I have access to all of the ships again. So let's just check out the Hornet real quick. I grabbed the Hornet, not really thinking. I just went to the retrieval terminal. I was like, let's look at the Hornet today. And then we did that. There is one, two, three, four, five, six MFDs. So pretty cool screens and then some like Ram dims down there. And then, uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, we're looking at, there's an awesome joystick in the middle. looks like we may have a turning signal on this bad boy as well. So pretty cool technology. Um, and then th that's it. The field of view is amazing. I love it, <laughs> but, but, but that's about it. That's about all there is to this ship. So let's go ahead and put her back. Uh, we did see that it is equipped with Dos Panther repeaters. And if you're going to be a repeater, be a Panther repeater, because those things are freaking sweet. Dude. Please proceed to assigned landing. Bay. Yes, we can. Okay, perfect. This is pretty cool, you guys. You put up the... Uh, oh, the wind. Oh, she's real. Oh, my God. So you put up the uh, landing gear, or you put down the landing gear, and the wings do a little thing. Check this out. Landing gear landing gear pretty freaking sweet so let's go ahead and put her on down and do a little walk around on the outside somewhere around here is my little place i call home here we go all right so i know if we hold down n for uh, landing gear then we will auto land i've never really needed it i'm just so good at landing i mean look at all these guys watching me they're like dude how does the good gamer do it I don't know, man. First time ever to land this thing. So, let's shut her down. Let's jump on out. So, just right off the bat, I say that. We're like three or four minutes into the episode already. Um, there's no ramp to get in here. Did someone lose a hubcap right there? You guys, uh, you guys need that for your Civic? All right. Yeah, there's no ramp or anything um, in the back. It's just this amazing little uh, jet engine afterburner thing. And then we got our wings. And then we've got our Panther Repeater 1. And our Panther Repeater Dose. Some amazing lighting. Would you look at that landing gear? Which, let's be honest, it's uh, a little lackluster on this bad boy. But what do you expect? You don't need a huge landing gear with this guy. Our keep clear sign. Okay. And then, um... Danger hot exhaust. So you have it. Um, the F7 Hornet. It's a pretty cool looking ship. I'll be honest with you guys. The Anvil F7C Hornet. Sweet. Let's go look at another ship. How does one get out of... Okay, here we go. Over this way. We're sorry. All right. You exceeded the allotted time to depart. We will have to return your ship to storage. That's fine. That's fine. Go right ahead. Okay, it's just a little Hornet. She's good to go. All right, you guys, so I want to do something a little bit different. I'm going to close my eyes. Shut it. I'm trying to talk. Uh, I'm going to go. Oh, my God. I'm going, to, I'm going to close my eyes. And I'm going to scroll, and I'm going to pick one. So I need to make sure I'm over here on retrieve. I don't know what I'm going to get. You guys are going to, just going to have to trust me. That Initiating ship storage procedure. Okay. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm going to scroll, and I'm going to pick one. Um... Maybe right about here. Oh, I'm clicking. I don't hear anything. There we go. Something happened. Okay. All right. looks like we picked one. Retrieving vehicle? I have no idea what I picked, you guys. Honestly, I don't have a clue. You just have to trust my... Take my word for it. Um, I just hope it reclaim or reclaims. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> what if I click, click the reclaimer? That would be awesome. What if it... Uh... Okay. Good, good, good. Hangar five. I was gonna say, what if it doesn't uh, doesn't claim it or or spawn it? What I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Just let's let's go. You guys know what I'm looking at. I have no idea. 
call elevator. Ooh, I'm so excited. Watch it be something tiny. Tiny, hello. Hangar five. Was, was, that, was that guy just sitting in here waiting? It's a little sus. Oh, here we go. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. <gasps> what? <laughs> it is. It's another little ship. Look at this cute little guy. Wait. Wait, what? Hangar 5. Am I on Hangar 5? Oh, hold I'm so confused. I don't know what I picked. Uh, let's just look at this one real quick, I guess. No, nope, that's... All right, let's just go ahead and move on. Uh, I'm so confused. <laughs> what is happening? This is a hangar bay exit point one. All right. No, we're in hangar eight. I'm supposed to be on five. Dude, that guy threw me off. Hangar five. Okay, now I saw it. I saw it, you guys. Anvil Carrick. <gasps> oh, is that that big one? Oh, I hope this is a big one. Oh, oh, yes. Yes, this is a huge one. Oh, look at that blue tint on the window. Or no, maybe it's just clear and the ceiling's blue. Oh, anyway, dude, look at the size of this bad boy. Oh, this thing is crazy cool. So I've been on this ship once. And I'll be honest with you guys, beware of blast. Oh, good lord. Uh, uh it, it, There was a lot. There was a lot to it. And I didn't get to like, I walked through it. But I'm going to take a little bit more time touring it on this one. Because I didn't do it with you guys. Oh, look at that turret. Oh, my gosh. So that's a manned turret for sure. And in the ceremonial, check out the landing gear. Because, my God, look at this landing gear. And it looks like it may be a VTOL, right? Yeah, yeah, like this is a big thruster. Let's just look up inside the thruster. Is that the igniter? <laughs> no. Oh, this is crazy cool. Is this VTOL? We'll find out. We'll find out. I'm sure it is. This is huge. Like, massive. And so we have an under turret as well. Is this one manned? Oh, it... Uh... Maybe it is. I bet you the, the seat scooches down from the ceiling right there. Oh, crazy cool. And let's look at the rear end of this thing. Good lord. We can't even see it all. Oh... Dude. All right, let's figure out how to get on this thing. It looks like we have one entry point, and it is up this way towards the front. Is that right? I don't know. Let's check it. And this front landing gear, though? Good Lord. I don't know what it is about landing gears on ships, man. They are, uh, I don't know. They're just, they're just really cool to look at. Very, very impressive. Oh, oh, I should probably move out. I'm staring at the landing gear still. I'm going to get squished. Ooh, look at the engineering on that ramp. Ooh, I love that. Those little guys came out. It's kind of like a U-Haul ramp. <gasps> oh, and it almost lined up perfect. It did. It lined up perfectly to the little stripe. Well done, guys. All right, let's not run. Because uh, that is Star Citizen Bible. Thou shalt not run. There we go. And that's why I've been tripping coming, in, coming up the ramps, you guys. I know. Everybody knew it but me. Now... Okay, no, there it goes. I was going to say, I hear the ramp closing, but I don't think it is. Now, this right here, if I remember correctly, this raises this little bad boy. So we can park our rock in here, and this will be like our bumper that tells us when to stop. So we don't run into uh, this door right here. Now, we do have a little door right here. Service ladder. Okay. All right. Let's, let's go and open. Now, uh, elevator docking collar. That is really cool. Cargo. So we're going to tour this whole thing. I'm going to look at all... Oh, my gosh. Dude, what does this remind you guys of? That's no moon. That's a floating ball of death in space. All right, so let's um let's come on through here. The end of... Oh, my God, the end of this freaking hallway. Elevator. We came to an elevator. Let's go on up. I don't know what's over here. Okay, I'm really excited. We're going to check all of this out. But I want to get out of the uh, the docking bay because you know these guys here. They are... Uh, oh, my God. Four, <laughs> four floors on this ship. Uh, maybe 
a cartography deck? What? Habitation technical deck, maybe? I don't know, you guys. Like, uh, whichever one I pick, I'm, I'm assuming it's going to be the wrong one. I just need to get to the bridge. Oh. Dude, this is crazy cool. Hangar Bay. Can... Can we... Can we park something in there? Dude! Alright, I'm getting really excited. Uh, let's open this up. I think... I think we're heading the right way. There's another elevator right there. Oh my god, the elevators! The doors! There's so much! Bridge. Oh, here we go. We found the bridge. Alright. Open. Oh! Oh, this is cool. There's another bridge right here. Ugh. Sneeze at it. <clears throat> okay, wow, that was so incredible. Uh, it made me sneeze. <laughs> Look at this thing. Dude, there's like... I don't, even, I don't even know what this is. This is epic. So it looks like, um... Oh, enter command station? <gasps> Dude, no way. No way. So this is not the pilot, and this is not the co-pilot, right? Gunner seat, no way! So we actually don't even have a captain's chair. They give us this platform that's sticking out over the big window. And they call it a command station. Oh, that is freaking epic. You guys think you got a command station there? Well, look at me, ma'am. Oh, that's a dude. Okay, sorry, my bad. Uh, let's go ahead and start her on up. And, oh, dude, I want to look at this thing. Oh, she's a little shaky. I don't know. <gasps> that is epic. Dude, there's a little window on top. This thing is massive. <gasps> Wait a second. Look below us. So we're standing up here on like the almighty deck. We're in their command station. But down below us, there's three chairs. Oh, I think I remember this. I think the middle one is the captain's chair. We can either command the ship from the command deck up top. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The upper bridge and the lower bridge. All right. We're taking off. Take off. Oh, man. It's a heavy one. It's a heavy one for sure. Are we even going to fit? Oh, my God. I don't know if we're going to fit, you guys. Could they have given us a smaller hangar? That's my question. I think we're good. We actually... <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Get up. Get up. Collision alert. Oh, no, 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 no. Dude, I didn't even move. Oh, Oh, say goodbye to my little turret. Oh, and they're already closing the doors on us. Thank you. Please. Yeah, you know what? Lorville? Dude, this thing... Okay, I don't know what's going on. It's like windy. It's crap out here. Uh, they gave us the largest ship and the smallest freaking hangar. Um, you can tell it's a big ship. It is not turning on a dime. Man, it feels like there's a lot of weight behind me, too. Because, I mean... <laughs> Good lord, look at the size of this thing. Alright, so we got a turret underneath. We have a turret on top. We've got a turret on this side. We've got a turret on this side. Are there any little guns on the front? I don't know. I'm not seeing any right away. God, just freaking sweet, man. Alright, perfect. So we're on cruise control, heading out into the stars, into the unknown. Dude, look at the view. Gosh. Really, it's just look at the glare off the windshield. But, dude, this is this is really freaking cool. So, now that we're out of the uh, friendly zone and we're in space, let's check out some of this stuff. Now, this chair, I think I saw I said it was a gunner's chair. All right, then let's go ahead and uh, maybe turn on the guns, question mark? Is this a... Uh Dude, I don't know. The... Okay, interesting. Uh, yeah, my little hand cursor is lighting up, but it wasn't really showing me what I'm selecting. Hmm. Uh, this gives us the power triangle. I'm hearing things beep. Is that just is that just my uh, computer? Power off right there. Exit. Let's go ahead and exit. Yeah, it looks like we can just kind of manage some of the uh, power triangle there. Shields, weapons, and whatnot. Now, I'm assuming... The, this one over here is the same, right? If it just says gunner's seat, and this one says... Oh, no, 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 no. That one says support seat. This one's a gunner's seat. Let's check out the gunner's seat, then. 
I was wrong. So the one on the right is gunner. The one on the left is support. All right. So let's check out what kind of trouble we can get into inside of a gunner's seat. Uh, there's enter remote turret. Oh, this is the big turret on top. Now, it looks like we have rhino. Uh, that's an energy weapon, right? Rhino repeater? Dude, look at it. All oh, those things. Dude, he's got like three barrels on each side. Look at that. Oh, okay. Yeah, I always hit F to try to zoom in and it gets me out. Oh, that's crazy cool. Now, we didn't have any ammo in there, but that's fine. Okay. Nice, nice. Uh, pull, catch to release. Okay, watch your step. So that's up here. And this bad boy, does this do anything? It doesn't. It just looks cool. Sweet. So there's an elevator right here. I don't know if we want to go down the elevators yet. Let's check out these here. Escape pods. Okay, so we got six escape pods up here. I don't know. Do they shoot out the top? Because there's a different there's a floor underneath us, right? Oh, dude, these louvered windows. Oh, is that the engine? Oh, there's a chair in there. Is that the engine room or what? What is this over here? Hold on. You guys, this is gonna be uh bear with me. Uh this is my first time like looking through the ship by myself. And with me as a tour guide, not having a clue what I'm doing. Yeah, it's bound to be exciting. Kind of like this door that <laughs> just doesn't open oh there's my wrenches dude i know i put them somewhere okay all right still using battery powered uh ax s power drill cool okay battery power drills are still a thing in the future we got a entry panel what this enters i don't know nor do i care now i don't know if there's any like secret compartments on this ship i'm gonna assume no, and it's probably going to get me in trouble. So let's go ahead and check over here in this amazing room. <gasps> Enter drone operation? What? Dude, uh, I feel like... Uh, I feel like I'm backwards. Am I... Should I not be facing this? <laughs> Hold on, what's happening? Oh, I was so excited about this seat, too. Uh, let's go ahead and get on out. Yeah, I feel like that is completely backwards, you guys. Right? Yeah. Oh, don't. Don't you dare send me out in the space. I don't know. I don't know. I can't get in. Dang it. Okay, well, that's a, that is a malfunctioning chair, if I've ever seen one. Now, right here, I've got some cords, some plugs. Um, this is a entry panel. Dude, there's a lot of entry panels on this ship. Hmm. It's maybe where we keep our space dogs. Alright. See, I feel like the chair should be facing me right now. And then when I get into it, then it faces the screens. Am I wrong? Like, is this... Am I missing something? Anyway. All right, let's move on out. Looks like we got some something up there. That's pretty cool. I mean, I'm loving the look of it. Such a cool feeling ship. Like, like it has a cool feel to it. And I feel like, yeah, sometimes you guys, I just get in this let's go bro stance. All right, now I've just got a little captain in me. All right, let's just move on. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. So hangar. Escape pods. Okay. Dude, there's a hangar. Hold up. Oh my god. Should we be concerned about this? <laughs> Alright, well, um, we'll just disregard that. We'll assume everything's fine. Uh, this is a technical deck habitation. Uh, so this is just another uh, elevator that... Oh, open door. The, uh... <gasps> Dude, no way. Oh, I bet we could fit a snub fighter in here, yeah? Oh, is it? It's probably a really bad idea to open one of these doors while the roof is open. Let's try it. Oh, the 
this is so cool. Oh man, so yeah, this is a uh, this is a hangar. Now it doesn't look like we can fit a very big ship in here, but it is a hangar and it is freaking sweet. All right, so was there anything down there? I don't think there was. Now, I'm assuming this side is identical. Same thing. Yeah, it looks like there's no other doors that way. So we're making our way back towards the rear of the ship. Here's a turret right here. Let's check out this turret. <gasps> that is so cool. Look, look at this. Oh, this has such a cool feeling to the ship, you guys. It, It's just amazing. I'm loving it. All right, let's not get too cocky getting in this turret here. Oh, sun in my eyes. Nailed it. All right, so it looks like we're on. These uh, decrease sensitivity. Oh, it's these again. Okay, reset. Switch fire mode. Gyro mode. Let's just look around. Oh. Oh, this is so cool. Like, come at me, bro. So these are rhinos. Oh, they have the three barrels too. So this is what this is the uh, the kind of guns that are on top, the rhinos, the rhino repeaters, right? They are repeaters, right? I think they are. That is really cool. I love it. And then we just turn around. Oh, and the blast doors close behind us to protect us in case we get boarded, I would assume. And they're double Yeah, double doors. Dude, don't even mess with me when I'm in my turret. All right, so let's come over this way. I'm trying to go kind of fast, but I mean, there's so much here. I don't think I can go fast enough to make this a short video. <gasps> oh my God. Is it, are those the engines or is that cooling? Dude, that is freaking sweet. Look at this. So, so, so far, not a whole lot has been interactive. I mean, we do have some elevators and stuff. But there's a bunch of panels. This is going to be the exact same side. Yeah, another turret on the other side. That's on the other uh, VTOL wing. I'm calling it VTOL. I don't think it actually is. Or uh, I don't know. It may be. Engineering. Check this out. We have an elevator in engineering. Oh, this. Keep clear. Is that radiation I'm hearing? Oh. Oh. Oh, my God. Dude. Okay, everything is looking normal. Does that say chocolate? <laughs> what? Level of zoom display. We've gone chocolate. Dude, that's really I I don't I don't know what that is. What the crap? Chocolate. Alright. Quantum jump drive. Let's go ahead and just stay out of there. Oh, we can uh, is this blip okay on the chocolate display? I think all is good. So we have an elevator right there. I'm assuming the ladder right here goes to the same place the elevator goes. Okay. Got a little droid on our ship, it sounds like. Dude, are these like secret access panels? I don't know. Open door. Is this a good idea or a bad idea? Oh, we got a star twerk, you guys. Okay. This ship just got even more cool. It's got a star twerk. Let's go. Uh, dude, I love this. I absolutely love this. It's like a catwalk up there. It's a two-story, but there's like, you can see through, like it's open. You know what I'm saying? Like this is just crazy cool. And there's the, the elevator, which I'm assuming it only goes between these two little floors, right? It's not gonna go down below that. Yeah, no, okay. So this engineering is pretty freaking sick. Dude, got this bad boy right here. Just some little compartments right here. Nice. This is really cool. These, the dude, the the detail, the detail in Star Citizen, it never ceases to blow my mind. Like we're on the lower engineering right now, and it doesn't go anywhere, but there's still full detail down here. Like, dude, I don't know, I don't know. The 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 attention to detail that the devs and designers and everybody put in this game, it's just. Like I said, it just blows my mind. And it's, it's really the words I have for it right now. It's just bad. It is so cool. So now I'm lost. There's turret that way. I think maybe we go up the center of the ship out here. Yeah, right here. So this is the main elevator. 
got it. Now, this is engineering. We've been on the technical, which I'm assuming is engineering. Let's go all the way up to the cartography deck, which, I mean, does your ship have a cartography deck? Dude. I don't know what this... I just clicked something. I have no idea what I just did. Oh, I turned it on. I turned it on. Dude, look at that. What is that? Is that a window? I don't know. I'm stuck on it, though. Okay. I don't know what that was. Um, This is sweet. Wow. Okay. Really cool. All right. Let's just come on out this way. We have... Uh, this is armor storage, right? I know. I'm learning, you guys. I'm learning. Airlock? Do we <laughs> do we open it? Of course we do. Oh, this is... Uh, <gasps> can we go... Oh, we can go up here. So if this door was closed, we could like... Oh, please tell me this door opens back up. Okay, thank God. Yeah, we could like set up some lawn chairs. We could like nail them down out there. And drink out of canteens and stuff it'd just be really cool this is really cool what a view of the elevator i love it all right looks like maybe more armor storage let's go ahead and see what's back it has a skate pod let's actually not go see what's <laughs> in there is that it i mean uh, i say is that it this is absolutely amazing we can go outside on top of this ship no freaking way so technical deck we've been there let's go down to habitation Oh, I can't wait to see what kind of uh, rooms this place has. Ooh. Ooh. It's a little noisy on the habitation deck. I guess it's background noise for when you're trying to sleep. What am I even looking at? Oh, fogged glass. Okay, okay, okay. So we're on deck two. Let's just immediately take a right. Uh, okay, it looks like I found our very first door that doesn't open. That's not an escape pod. Nice. <gasps> Medical! Ooh! Oh, look at this. Dude. This is either decontamination or these are all the uh, loudspeakers you could possibly want. Look at this place. So, Medical... It's not something that they fully implemented just yet, but I think they're going to release it in 315, right guys? Yeah, I'm looking pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, so we got a medical bed, so we can always come in here and heal if it's within a certain tier of uh, injury, right? Because there's gonna be some tiers that we just can't repair. Okay, we got our medicinals in there. Alright, I gotcha, I gotcha. Uh, we got some relief, extra, sterile gauze. All right. Got gloves. Dude, we're like decked out. We even have a microscope made by Microtech. Oh, that's cool. All right. Look, it's like a little IV cart over there. Oxygen. Really, really cool. And in all the supplies and in all these medical records and all that stuff. Cool, cool, cool. So over here we have another bed. What is this? Doctor's office? Dude, the doctor has his own office. What is this? Smile. That's right, you guys. Always remember to smile. And this is a un unparceled gallery here. We will lay the groundwork for that by stuff and things. Okay, we probably shouldn't be reading the doctor's notes. We're just gonna leave this stuff out. Perfect. All right, doctor has their own server access. Sweet, and this is a med bay right here. Decon, uh, not decontamination. Oh, this is like an MRI machine. <gasps> Wait a second. Clear all ICU settings. What, dude? Uh, what? So we can actually like lay on this thing and get healed, right? I'm not gonna do it because there's nobody here to get me out in case the machine sucks me in and. Starts demagnetizing my brain and my thoughts are more scrambled than they normally are. Let's go ahead and leave. I think that's everything that we saw in there. Yeah, yeah. Dude. 
Uh, let's head on back this way. Our elevator looks like the main shaft <laughs> goes all <laughs> goes all the way up through the ship. All right, nailed it. Toilets. All right. You guys hearing things? I keep hearing like little squeaks. I I feel like it's possible the ship may be haunted. A couple of them. Be oh, 100% is haunted. We don't have a reflection. Uh oh. Uh, we got just our germicidal disinfectant. Okay. And one heck of a sink. Good lord. All right. Got some really, really cool things in here. Let's open these up. Now, I assumed they're showers. They, These are not showers. They're toilets because it said toilets. A little storage down there. This is really cool, you guys. This is food in the... No, it's not okay. Nice. Oh, no way they have Torm? No way. Sweet. All right. Let's check this out. Dude, it's this thing. It's not haunted. It's the free call filter fluctuations. Oh, okay. Now it all makes sense. All right. We got pool. Um, I'll be silver. You guys be stripes. All right, let's move on. Oh, bunk beds. Oh, sweet. So are these, oh, oh, epic. These are closets. These are all individual closets. I'm going to open them all. Okay, is our, our ship's a little wobbly right now. Did opening the closet doors throw us off kilter a little bit? Uh-oh. Bunk bed, you guys. So there's four bunks here. Really freaking cool. There's another bunk down here. So how many sets is that? That's, uh, oh, it's only two sets. Okay, so it's four, five. Sleeps five. I'm assuming that would pull out in some kind of bed. Showers. Here's the showers right here. Love it. Love it. Got the same kind of sink in here. I don't know why you need to sink when you've got showers, right? Oh, man. These are awesome. These are like the waterfall ones with with uh, auto doors. Hot, cold auto. Dude. Nice. How does all this stuff stay up? Like when I'm flying, right? I mean, the way I fly and the way I land, there's no way that uh, any of that stuff would still be upright. It would be, all be in one corner of the room. <laughs> Let's keep on moving. Go ahead. Thank you. All right. Uh, we have not been down here yet. Ooh, this is like the kitchen area. Are we okay out there? I'm thinking we're okay. Yeah, I think we're fine. This thing would not be annoying at all. <gasps> Dude, are we picking up? alien frequency no way all right so we got a uh, food 3d printer that prints it right out in the sink that's terrifying cut that out good lord it's a bit creepy okay we've got our takeout containers nice okay loving it loving it what's going on here okay all right so we got a brainiac here dude someone's eating oh Butter not squash cereal or something. And, <laughs> and a digital camera from 10 years ago. Sweet. Love it. Love it. Awesome place. Still making our way back. Um we're on deck two, right? I think I think we're on deck two. Now we've seen the very top deck. We saw technical. <gasps> oh, this is my room. This is really freaking cool. Terra. So is that Earth? Okay, what am I drinking? Freaking blue. Okay, schmaltz. Okay, yeah. Why not? Hmm. Amazing. Amazing. I love the uh, shelf lighting. Yeah, it's really cool. And it'd be really cool to... Oh, we got a chessboard here, too. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Nice, nice. It'd be cool to be able to customize this. Like, maybe if I buy a uh, storm wall plushie, I may be able to stick it up there. All right. And I've got... Ooh, my cigars. Okay, okay. Um, I'm going to assume that is a priceless piece of art. Okay. Another piece of art. Very nice. I'm loving the little AC vents. That's what these are, right? They're like little air vents. Loving it. 
Okay, this is my own sleeping quarters. Dude, what? I got a thing for teddy bears, right? I've got <laughs> I've got one right there. Maybe they're like the nanny cams and they have like cameras in them and they, they're always on to make sure that no one ever comes into my chambers. There's my armor storage, just a normal closet. Is this a chocolate monitor too? No, it's not. Planetary stuff. My bed. I have my own little sink. Okay, looks like an android. Very nice, very nice. My plant covering all my toiletries. First aid for, I guess, my assumption would be for when I shave. A toilet with, oh crap, handles. <laughs> and then a shower. Okay, love it. And then a fire alarm. Gotta have a fire alarm. And a random ceiling handle. Alright, so let's come on out this way. Main hall. Dude, it got bright over here. Oh, we're back at the bridge. Oh, this oh, this is the lower bridge. Okay, okay. Dude. These servers do a lot of talking, that's for sure. Look at this. Hold up. Hold up. Can we walk out here? Am I gonna clip through? <gasps> Ooh, we're doing it! Oh, <laughs> no way! Look at us! So we can see the top bridge and the bottom bridge. Oh, this is freaking sweet. Now, co-pilot, and this one's co-pilot too, right? Yeah, co-pilot, because there's only one pilot. This guy. Dude. Uh, and then I... Yes! Wow, it's a little fast. Made me a little dizzy. Dude, look at these little MFDs. Nice. So now we can power on from down here. We can take over. Now my question is, what happens when someone is on the top command station and I'm down here and we're both trying to go in specific directions? I don't know. I don't know. Don't really care at this point. Let's go ahead and get on out. We're going to point towards the planet for some unheard of reason. I don't, I don't really know. <laughs> I don't know what that was about. I think I'm just heading back to uh, to land. Okay, it's pretty sweet, pretty sweet. Now, have we? Oh, open. Uh, tank two, uh, APU fuel valves. We have that, but I haven't seen any like armor or not armor. Uh, weapon storage up here, right? Like, have we seen any? Is there an armory on this ship? What is this? Uh, it said radar. Oh, maybe we put things in here to hide them if another ship is scanning us for radar? Question mark? Captain's dorm. Okay, we've seen all that. Yeah, okay. I don't really know you guys. I don't know what, what that radar box is for. But yeah, we haven't seen an armory. We saw the metal. We saw all that. So let's just head down. Habitation. Yeah. So sub deck. This will be the last deck. Deck one. Here we go. So docking collar. Uh, this is more armor storage. Oh, oh, are these the, is this the weapon storage? No. Oh, we can open these. Oh, cool. Let's go ahead and close them. I don't want to get sucked out into space. All right. And then elevator. That's garage. This is... Oh, okay. So this is where we came in. Gotcha. Whoa! Okay. Uh, these go down, right? A little elevator? Yeah. Catwalk. Do my little thing on the catwalk. Yeah, on the catwalk. Okay. S12. This is a little... It's just a little storage place. Now... Uh, I'm wondering if, like, huh. I'm thinking a lot of thoughts in my head. I'm not communicating to you guys. So how do we get stuff in these storage? Like, this is all storage room, right? Like, how do we get items in here? Because I don't, I don't, this is big enough to carry a rock, right? It may not be tall enough, but it's definitely long enough and wide enough. Maybe those doors open? Am I... Am I just dumb? That's calling an elevator. This little red button, do not push the red button. Okay. I don't know, you guys. Like, we have all the storage 
But it's kind of a pain to get to if we have to come through the back and come to each one of these and fill it up, right? And then to empty it is just as big of a pain. But I'm not seeing... Let me go check it out real quick. One more time. See if there's like a side panels or whatever. Because sometimes you guys tell me, like, this has to open, right? That looks like a hydraulic, so it opens. Yeah, these have to open. Sometimes you guys tell me, you're like, oh, you missed a, a button. It's right there on the side, goodish. And I'm like, no, it's not. But it, it probably really is. All right, so anyway, I don't know, you guys. Um, hmm, a little confused about that one. Elevator, that goes up. We have some more. This is a weapons locker. Here we go. Oh, it's just it's just this. Okay. I mean, that's good enough. There's two, four, six, eight with some handguns and other stuff. We have more armor storage down here. More armor storage down here. Is this another weapons? Oh, okay. No, no, no. We're good. We're good. So everything's on the lower deck. This is the aft turret. Uh, oh, this is really cool. Yeah, so this is going to go down through the floor. Which then becomes the ceiling of the lower turret. Yeah, see? And we need to power this one on. There we go. These are rhinos as well. So are rhinos or panthers better? Ah, so cool, man. So cool. All right, are you anything? No, you're not. So the back of the ship is just this one turret. I say just, but it's, <laughs> it's pretty epic. Yeah, and then all the armor storage, all the weapon storage. And then behind us is the elevator to go back up to the other floors. Pretty, pretty freaking cool. And I also wanted to check back here too. Yeah, we've got an elevator here. A docking collar. So that's elevator. Yeah, oh yeah, we came down to the elevator. I've already seen that. But there's also a service ladder. Oh, this is sweet. Dude. There's little cubbies all over the place. Okay, this is it like a Jeffrey's tube. Oh. Where does this come out at? Is this that door that was locked earlier and we couldn't get in? <gasps> I think it is, you guys. Let's make our way back to the deck. Or back to the bridge, rather. And head on back to Lorville. You guys, I'm going to have to cut this one a little bit short something has come up but thank you guys so much for checking the ship out with me i really appreciate you guys let me know if i missed anything in it i feel like i did a pretty good job touring this one and checking everything out we got the ramp in the front yeah and we got the the uh the roof up there which we opened and it was a hangar we looked at the different turrets we looked at a whole bunch of different stuff still gotta figure out that storage under there because they look like little storage garages but anyway you guys, you know what to do. If you like it, the video, make sure you leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you guys haven't. And thank you so much for hanging out with me today. And I will see you guys in the next one. This is The Goodish Gamer signing out.